Welcome to part two of Life in the City of Sonoma. I hope you enjoy it. I'll talk about more highlights and things you might be interested in if you're relocating here and you're gonna make this your new home. So here we go on part two. So I talk about living in Sonoma in three categories. You have your country, farm animal, vineyard, uh, agriculture, environment, and then you have your urban world too, where they both kind of mesh together beautifully. So we have the urban conveniences of box stores, big box stores like Walmart and Target and what have you, just 20 minutes over the hill in the city of Petaluma. And then we have the city elements too, because San Francisco is only an hour away if you just have to see a Broadway show or you're gonna go sailing or something. And then you also have the Wheel Center, which is on the Sonoma State University campus, and the Luther Burbank Center in Santa Rosa, just another 15 minutes up the road. So when you're living in the city of Sonoma, you've got that real country thing going on, and you have the urban conveniences, and then the city stuff is not too far away if you just need to go to an opera or a ballet or into San Francisco. It's really, really nice. You kind of get a little bit of everything. The shopping in Sonoma is really pretty good. Now, you don't have the big box stores. If you're gonna go to Target or Walmart or, or you need a Macy's or a Nordstrom's, those are good a half hour away. But if you want a little boutique shopping, find some really unique things, uh, downtown uh, Sonoma at the Plaza is a great place to shop. Let's talk about the dining in Sonoma. I love the dining in Sonoma. So you can do everything from dining around the plaza with Della Santino's and the Depot and the Swiss Hotel and the Girl in the Fig and there's lots of great white tablecloth kind of dining. There are two movie theaters in Sonoma. One that's a regular movie theater and the other is the art film theater right on the plaza, the Letson Theater. And that's a really fun place to go to the movies. It's very old fashioned. So it's a lot of fun. So we have some good theaters in Sonoma. He's listening in. <coughs> So let's talk about transportation. So there are buses around the city of Sonoma and you're only 20 minutes from the smart train which is in the city of Petaluma and that can take you all the way through Marin County down to Larkspur where you can take a ferry into San Francisco. Let's just say you're going to a Giants game or something. That's pretty convenient and a nice way to travel. Now let's talk about airports. So we're about an hour and a half away here in Sonoma from the San Francisco airport and the Oakland airport. So um, you got to make time if you're going to travel to the big airports. But um, there's two good things. There's the Sonoma Express, which you can take from uh, the city of Petaluma into San Francisco and Oakland. And that is an airporter uh, service that is just fantastic. So I'd rather take that any day than drive my car and do the whole parking thing at the airport. It's really great. Now, even better than that is the Charles Schultz Airport in Santa Rosa. This is a great airport. They have lots of flights going to popular places and uh, they're doubling the size of that airport. So there'll be a lot more uh, flights coming in and out in the future. A lot more, there's several new buildings that are going to be going up. So that's the Charles Schultz Airport in northern Santa Rosa. So we've got a lot of great transportation around this county. Sonoma City does as well. And um, well, there's a lot of good convenient transportation in Sonoma. It's about an hour to get to the San Francisco Bay. So you can go sailing and live in Sonoma. There's a great hospital in Sonoma, the Sonoma Valley Hospital, and many doctors come here from San Francisco and Marin County to practice during the week, so they might have two offices. So we have great health care in Sonoma. Hey, it's Anita, and I hope you enjoyed learning a little bit about living in this beautiful city of Sonoma. I am doing a three to four part series which we're working on right now with GoPro tours of all the beautiful neighborhoods here. So those are coming up down the pipe. And so hit the subscribe button and the little bell and you'll be the first to know when those start popping up on YouTube. I also have free buyer's guides and relocation guides in links right below here. They are free. So click on them and they'll come up in an ebook form. This is Anita Anderson with Discover Sonoma County Living and check out the upper right hand corner for the next video. I'll see you around the neighborhood.